Hello, hello, hello. Again, it's me, Chanel here. And today I have a DIY coffee bar slash coffee station area that you can do in your home. Good day, everyone. It's me, Chanel here. And this is my kitchen area. If you're going to be enjoying that morning cup of joe, noonday cup of joe, or coffee as some have called it, well, why not make it a great experience? You know, I like all things that are functional, but as well as them being functional, I like them to be pretty. I'm going to just bring you along as I just dress up this credenza over here, or rather my buffet area, which is what I'm going to style it up on. And since it's in the kitchen, I'm gonna call it a buffet. Buffet, you can call it a credenza, whatever it is that you would like. Or not a coffee drinker, well, like me. I actually like to drink cocoa. Cocoa is my beverage of choice. But I do have a lot of people around me who do enjoy coffee. We are gathering, once again, in small doses. Why not make it a great experience and pop up one morning early and just get out all of your supplies and just adorn your area if you have something like this. And if you don't, you can use something as simple as a coffee table or perhaps maybe a end table or even in your kitchen. And if it's a small area, again, you could just bring in a simple little table like that and set up a small and quaint little coffee area. A few simple items right from our cupboards, our pantries, cabinets, whatever you want to call it, those storage areas. I am going to be adding up a coffee maker of some sort. You will definitely need that or in my case a cocoa maker. And again after you have added your coffee maker here up top of your cadenza you can go ahead and adorn the area with all the different items that you would like to see or that is necessary. You can add some simple things like some fresh fruits. You can add you some delightful things donuts and cookies so you can have your little snack as well in the morning and family and friends would just love to arise early in the morning you can just invite them over and say we're going to have coffee this morning maybe on a Sunday morning or early on a Saturday morning I was young and I remember how we would get up early on I mean it would be really early or Saturday morning before we went to the farmer's market and my uncles and a couple of aunts would come over to the house or they would just travel you know from house to house and they would go to each other's house and they would drink coffee early in the morning and they would just sit there and have quick little conversations and whatnot maybe for about an hour or so maybe 45 minutes and then off we would go to the farmer's market or garage sale and do we would do that I always had to be in tow so I was getting up early because I would smell the coffee cooking the coffee being made you get the point. I like to get up early in the morning and travel, of course, with my mom and my dad and do whatever it is that we were gonna do early in the morning. And my favorite definitely was going garage selling and to the farmer's market. Add you some items, again, that you would need. You can add a snack area, as I'm going to do here in the video. And instead of just placing them in the containers that you may have picked them up from your local market, you can pull them right out of the containers and place them on top of a plate, a simple plate that you have. Maybe it's a white plate, whatever the color is that you have in your cabinet, and pull that right out and adorn all of your snacks on different in your basic kitchen household items like your bowls, your plate stands, your cake stands. You can use those as well just to give them some different lifts and levels. Different things to take your eye around the grazing area that you're going to place all of your cups that your guests will be using to drink their coffee. And what I'm I'm going to add me some greens to the area because I just have to have my florals and different leaves or whatever. It just adds my life to gourmet syrups. Now you can use these syrups in different types of drinks, but I picked these up because I know my daughter, she does like these types of syrups, adding them some extra different flavors to her coffees. And so I just wanted to offer them something a little bit different to the mix. And these are some gourmet coffee syrups that I picked up, but you can pick up any type that you would like at your local markets. And uh, I just thought they were very lovely and I did like the apothecary type old style 
amber glass that these have come in and they are great for preserving the items that are in here like oils as well and the charm of your areas and if you have just use some pretty little napkins again we're going to use a lot of things that we already have here in the house you have to go out and just purchase different things your pantries again your closets your <laughs> storage drawers wherever it is again that you put all these things and I mean just your basic little napkin a pretty fold you take those and maybe cut them in half you're just doing this the functionality of it because you're already going to be having your coffee so why not again make it a great experience and what a great little surprise that is and how it looks to everyone who is coming to pick up their snacks and drinking their coffee or cocoa always take out your different curry cups and these are the different ones that you can use they come in many many different flavors a storage jar and it came with the lid and what I did was added this wood round and then I used the router and routed around the edges and just adorn it to make it just a little bit more pretty and a little bit more substantial place them inside of your jar and you can have a different jar maybe with three or four however many different coffees that you may be serving on that particular morning. Let's give it just a little bit more variety to your area. And again here, this is just a quick coffee bar slash coffee station area that you can use a lot of the things that you have right in your home already in your cabinets, in your pantry. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Continue to watch till the end. One for coming out and sharing a nice cup of coffee or rather cocoa with me this this has been chanel stay inspired motivated and moving to create something beautiful and pretty in your home or for someone else in the next one